Hey guys, Marjorie's sister for real. I got the tea kettle, baby, and you know I have the mic. Now, y'all may have heard the story, but I want to tell you first of God, first of all, God still answers prayers. <laughs> Tupac Shakur was shot and killed in 1996. Everybody, everybody, I know they were praying that his um, shooter be found. Well, allegedly he's been arrested. He's been arrested and he's known by Dwayne Davis, nicknamed Keefe D. And this all happened in Las Vegas, Nevada, after a brawl, brawl, a brawl. And I tell you, it was a fight. I mean... Can't we just all get along? Well, that fight, allegedly, it was taken to the streets. And in the streets, the young man that um, Tupac Shakur was throwing punches at, and he was throwing punches back at him, was Tupac Shakur hit the street. His uncle was there. His uncle. And, you know, during the time it happened, I remember a little bit about it. I can remember this person being interviewed, which now I know is Dwayne Davis. And he was answering questions and everything. I'm like, how he got there so quick, fast, in a hurry? I really did ask myself that question. And now, shouldn't the police have been asking, man, how you got here so quick in a hurry? How you know all this? But he was on the scene. But his... um. His nephew was the one that got in the fight with Tupac. His name was Orlando Anderson. I tell you, you can't go nowhere and, and nobody don't try to get into an altercation with you. Y'all be careful out there. Be, don't, don't be getting in no fight. Don't start no fight. And no, please don't let nobody start no fight with you guys. You know what I'm saying? Just turn the cheek, turn another cheek and keep going. Well, I am just so glad that that his alleged shooter has been arrested. Now, guys, bottom line, the law enforcement officers confiscated um, computers, a uh, computer out of his um, out of his living um, place where he was living. So they do have some information that has been confiscated. But I want to tell you guys now, do you guys? think that he act alone? Do you think that Wayne Davis act alone? Or was someone else involved? I'd like to get your feedback on that, but I just want to let y'all know prayers are still being, being answered.